ether, that shit that make your soul burn slow. What's up? I'm Attack Slug. This is the Cold Boot, where I look at new games and or DLC, and this is Ether One for the PS4. Apparently, it's been out on the PC for a while. I never heard of it, uh, and now it is out on the PS4. And this is the Cold Boot, so we're looking at it, and I have no idea what it is. Uh, I am told it is a first-person adventure that deals with the fragility of the human mind. Uh, but all I can think of is that Nas song, so, is what it is. Let's get right into it and see. So I, uh, being at, this is the cold boot, I, I can't continue, it is a new game, but let's look at our options first and foremost. Uh, we got gameplay options. Head, TV just went out. Head bar, you know, I'm gonna leave everything at the default, I suppose. Uh, audio, I see there's, uh, uh, no button for subtitles, that's, Nope. Alright, so either there's no dialogue or there's just, you know, no option for subtitles, which is unfortunate. But let us deal with this first-person adventure for a little bit that deals with the fragility of the human mind. And we all know that mind's pretty fragile as it is, so this should be fun. Uh, I like first-person games that kind of break the mold a bit. Uh, I thought that Antichamber was a phenomenal game. Okay, we do have the subtitles. Okay, sure. That works. Hey, it's Got an answering machine Listen, message here. I'm sorry for the things I said earlier on. It's just... God, I really don't think you should go to that place. I, I, don't, I don't think they care. Not like they should. Um, before you think it, I know how it feels to want to feel safe, to want more. You know I do it. Um... Jesus, do you know how I view you? Just another patient to squeeze money out of. Please. Were those no. subtitles supposed to be different than what the guy was saying on the phone? I'm freaking scared. You oh. for me. I'm already confused. Here we go. All right. Motion blur. What do we got here? Ether. That shit that make your soul burn slow. Uh. I will not lose. You'll never forget. Alright, getting some getting some Bioshock vibes here. Definitely getting some Bioshock vibes here. Okay. Square. Okay, here we go. What in the blue hell is going on here? Giant blue meteor. Hold L1 to identify Ethereal Rock. Okay. In the mid nineteenth century, advances in genetic and psychological sciences led to a series of astounding breakthroughs regarding the, the walking system. speed is very slow at the forefront of these experiments ether institute paging dr nas dr nas uh i'm sure everyone who's who's done a youtube video has probably made that joke already but um how is there oh yeah they're they're on that box is checked. I don't know how I didn't, didn't see that box before. I'm apparently blind, uh, or, you know, exhausted. One of the two. I get real close on it. I, not a lot of polygons on that bell. Is that... It is. Oh, this is excellent. Now I'm getting some, uh, so portal vibes here. We got here appointments. Let me let me sign in here. Attack slug. Today's the sixth, and it is like seven oh seven p.m. Oh, okay. How do I get? How do I? How do I? No. I can't tell what I'm on here. Oh, that's. Yes. All right. A. That seems like bad game design. If I can't tell what letter I'm on. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, and up. Down. One, two, three, four. Uh, One, two, down. Up. One, two, three, four, five. Down. Up. Like that seems like an obvious bug. It does not supposed to be like that. 
One, two, three, four, five, six. Nope. Up. And attack slug. All right, I'm signed in. Let us. I forgot what he else said to, to go to next. Let me in the door, please. Uh, all right, now I'm gonna be lost. Awesome. Ring the bell again. Hello. Nope. I am left to my own devices. Uh, I paid enough enough attention to sign in, but now I don't know where I'm going. So that's that looks. I'm pretty sure vents aren't supposed to do that. Like air conditioning is not supposed to do that. But hmm, I'm already very wary of this facility. Offices and gallery. This way. Now well, let's explore. That is an old monitor and an old. It's like a Commodore 64 and shit. Man. All right. Items can be placed her. Shouldn't that be here? Her? Alright, game, you're not impressing me with your attention to detail here. Uh, if I'm noticing this stuff. Okay, yeah, that guy's an asshole. Pranking his co-workers. Some kind of an explosive chair dealie. Alright, let's hit this button here. Nope, no access. Okay. So we're going to continue on down this hallway and walking at this tediously slow pace for a video game. That's... Oh. Oh. I should have paid more attention, shouldn't I? Oh, boy. Do we need a key card? Do we need to... I don't have any items. Oh, I can jump. Okay. Mm. Touchpad doesn't do anything. Uh, Ether 3.5, insufficient data recording. Uh, Alright, yeah, sure, fine. What else can I touch? Because this is not... Alright. Now, I'm not one to complain about, you know game design that makes you explore, but, uh, considering that not everyone's going to be paying the utmost of attention to the opening of your game, um, I couldn't hear that. Alright, let, let me, let me solve this issue real quick, uh, jump cut. And we are back. Ding, ding. So, if there are any more... Oh! Okay! Date. Today is... No, not three. No jump. Six? Not R? What the hell? Six. And the time is... <sighs> nope. Seven. Oh. Oh crap, I gotta actually put in the colon there, don't I? Nope. Seven ten, it's fine. Close enough. Alright, I've done your appointment book. I did it. Ooh, okay. There we go. Restoration procedure for patient. J. Whee! Zero, five, seven. We'll commence shortly. Staff are advised to prepare chambers for initial projection. Got it. Well, it seems we best get a move on. There's plenty to do. And for you, plenty to see and discover. If you say so. I'm going to be guiding you through the process of restoration this evening. And hopefully ensuring that nothing terrible happens to you. 
something terrible is going to happen to me. I can, I can assure you, it is a video game. Working on it. There we go. We have now officially done a video game thing. But man, this is certainly a slow start to this game. I will say that much. Uh, I'm going to room three, she said. So, room one seems uh, not good. So, let's head to room three here. Uh-oh. They have been anticipating my arrival. That could be good or that could be bad. Oh, this walking speed, though. Let me, let me see something here. Okay. Click the left stick to run. That is a good thing. And it's still not, not fast enough. Uh, but... Mm-hmm. But it would be nothing without the likes of you. 120, 75, 300, 75. That seems important somehow, but fuck if I know. Dear, help me with the setup. I need the electrical input for the What? You can access it from that terminal over there. What? Which what? Making me do work game with the hell. Beep. Seventy-five. This is like busy work the video game at this point. Where is the part where it's the, the fragility of the human mind? That's what I want to know. Uh, 300, 300, 120, 75A? Sure. How do I... Oh, wait. I gotta... I gotta put the key card down. God damn it. Running. There we go. Like... Do I not have pockets? Is that are are there no pockets in this universe? Just nah, you don't get pockets. Whatever. How do I pick it up? There we go. And then run back across the hallway. This is exciting. I I assure you, this is is as exciting for 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 me as it is for you. Nope. Hot potato. Now, button. Can you not do anything right? What? It's the 300 amp fuse that you need. It says clearly on the box. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Why would you have had a 75 in there in the first place? That seems unsafe. Okay, I don't... Getting all mad at me. There we go. Make sure. Yep. Like, what dumbass put in the wrong fuse in the first place? And how come it's my job to go fix it? I don't... No, yeah, put it in. No, put it in there. Noises. Oh, I got a silver trophy. That was fast. Oh. Inception! It's the Inception horns! Oh god! What could possibly go wrong? That seat looks kind of foreboding just a little bit. Just the teeniest, tiniest bit of foreboding seat. Oh boy, what's gonna happen here? Jean Grey, Phoenix. Uh oh, uh oh, no, I'm no. Hey, 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 hey! Not cool. Not cool. What's going on here? Plaque buildup. We're going to, to dental work. What? Oh no. I don't like any of this. This this is how Half Life One started. I don't like any of this at all. Relax, Mr. Freeman. 
I am here to help. Oh no. No, 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 no. I don't like that. I don't like any... Any of this. They're closing me in this room, aren't they? Yes, they are. This is... Okay. Yep. The start of every bad science experiment begins here. Oh, man. Oh! Alright. The end. <laughs> he died. The end. Now it's like Titanfall. I'm inside the Titan. Oh, no, no, we're in a Gundam. It's gonna... No, uh, not, not Gundam, uh... Evangelion. We, we are, we, we are in an Ava. It is Unit Zero One. We are Shinji. Uh, or is he Unit Zero Two? Uh, it's been a long time. Anyway, oh dear. Just remember to smoke weed every day. Uh. Alright, Dan. Shouldn't have done that. Just a boy. Mm, what is the hook of this game? I would like to know. So, yeah, this, this came out on the PC, like, mm, a couple of months ago, last year, something like that. Uh. And it may have already come to the Xbox One, I think, but the PS4 launch was part of PS Plus for the month of May 2015. So it was free for me. Well, free. Oh, great. Press triangle to teleport to and from the case. Oh. Hello, trees. How are you? Our sole purpose this evening is to track the memory and pinpoint its location so we can cleanse it of any disease present. Everything you're seeing in front of you is a visual environment pieced together from our client's subconscious mind. Barren wastelands or an abstract painting reimagined. It's all completely tangible. All right, Dan. All I can see are brain scans of tissue degradation confirming my previous diagnosis of dementia. Both are incredibly important if we are to succeed and understand our client's needs. Okay. Now, if you just give me a second, I'll have some more details for you. Nope. Feel free to explore in the meantime. <sighs> Alright, we're gonna explore in the meantime. They want to close the mine. The mine's dangerous. Engines. Can we, can we commit suicide? That is the first question in any video game. No, I cannot. I, want, I, just, I just want to end it all. Come on, let me end it all. Damn you, video game. Let me have freedom. I saw something blinking over here. I saw a blinking... No. Oh, that's what I saw. Okay, let's see what's over here. Man, fine glass. Note. Is that liquor? Miner's flask. Can I take it? Yes, please. All right, let's get drunk. A pipe. Smoke them, peach pipe. Nope, don't need it. No, I want the... Oh, this really is an adventure game, isn't it? You can always store it in the case. Henry's raisins. Sweeter than ever. Alright, well, being that this is totally an adventure game, uh, this video is pretty much done for all intents and purposes because uh, having to use my brain to solve adventure game puzzles and talk at the same time, not a plausible thing uh, by any stretch of the imagination. Uh, so... I'm gonna just walk a little bit farther, and then <clears throat> and then call it there because uh, I don't know what I should be doing 
where I should be going. Okay. Ooh, video games. I'm sure that code is in the environment somewhere. I gotta solve a puzzle to get to it. And we're not gonna do that. That is for diddly darn sure. I just want to jump into the water. I want to swim. I want to be free. Ah. Uh, and I'm trapped in this video game. Oh, that opens. Cool. What's in here? Nothing. Suitcases. Dirty dishes. And a big fat pile of nothing. Awesome. Phenomenal. What do we got here? What secrets does the lighthouse hold? Uh. Safety helmets. Yeah, this is definitely very much uh, adventure game-ish type shenanigans. But in the first person. Oh, that seems important. Let me stick my hand in that. Nope. I guess not. Okay. We'll go a little bit farther here. And look at this, which doesn't do any... That's... no. Nope. None of this is useful. None of this is useful. So, that's gonna do it for Ether 1. That shit that makes your soul burn slow on the PS4. Uh, it is part of the May PS Plus update, so if you have PS Plus and this looks intriguing to you, if you like adventure games in the first person that deal with the fragility of the human mind, then feel free to check out Ether 1 uh, for free right now if you are a subscriber to PS Plus, which you should be because it's, it's, it's a pretty good value. Um, and uh, that's going to do it. I'm going to go back and uh, look at something pretty before we... Oh, flowers. Okay. 2D flowers just couldn't even be bothered making 3D. It's just a freaking sprite. Some doom shit going on right there. Um, so we're gonna sit here and stare at this lighthouse. A man, a boat, a lighthouse, or was it a man, a gun, a lighthouse, Bioshock Infinite. So we're gonna sit here and, and end this video staring at the, the staring at the Bioshock Infinite lighthouse and say that this has been Ether One on the PS4. This has been the Cold Boot, and as always, I am your host, Tax Slug, and I will see you next time right here on the channel. And I'm out.